Hey everybody, and welcome back to more Amiibo Mage Adventures. Uh, as you can see, we are still trapped within our um, cave of horrors. Got uh, all the ice that was left in the massacre, the icy massacre that just took place. All the dead bodies are still here. Uh, yeah, let's just, uh, keep, keep going. I've still got my, my trusty robes on. Let's see what lies, lies ahead of us here in this other cave. Apparently I can level up, but we'll do that in a second. I, uh, kind of really want to see what's going on back here. Hopefully there's not more enemies there are some cages we can unlock which I am always up for especially the ones like that that just basically open themselves I didn't even have to move the analog stick uh oh this one's is gonna be a lot more complicated I have to actually figure this one out oh there it is oh I felt the rumble so slight. Uh, maybe you can hear my cat crying in the background. He's jealous of the amoeba mage getting all my attention. So he likes to sit in the hallway and cry. Which usually works to get my attention, but right now I'm in the middle of adventure. So he's going to have to wait a little bit. We'll see how long it takes them to actually come in here and hassle me in person. Ooh, nice dead body. Freshly dead. All right, was that it? There's just a random dead body with some treasure on it. I don't... We didn't come this way, did we? This is weird. No, I know we came from the bottom this is all how do I where is map there's the map yeah so we're heading the right way uh, looks like there was some side entrances back there that we did not look in I don't what I don't believe it I guess oh I guess they mean up there. Uh, we'll we'll deal with that later. Maybe this will loop back around up top. Let's go see if we can kill some. I mean, find some things to kill. Even though it looks like somebody already came through here and killed everything for us. This is exciting. I appreciate it when enemies can kill themselves for me so I don't have to set them on fire. Uh, this is uh, not as exciting as I thought it was. Uh oh. That doesn't look good. Warning. You've all been warned about trying to break into my treasure room, but Roars didn't think I was serious. Roars? Really? Now he's dead! You've all had your cut of the take already. And if I catch any of you dung lickers trying to break in again, I won't let the traps kill you. I'll do it myself. Rigel Strongarm. The dung licker. Wow. Um, okay, I'm gonna guess he's back there hanging out. So let's, let's go see what's going on in this doorway. Ooh, another locked door. I'm not gonna need a key for this one. Not over there. Uh, let's see, getting warmer. Oh, that was a big one. I felt it. There we go. Look at all this treasure in this uh, 
boy, that's not suspicious. Um, I guess that goes off if I mess up, mess this up. So let's try not to do that. Uh, let's see. No, that's not it. It's kind of hard to tell sometimes when the where the big vibration is. Okay. Oh, there it is. Oh, right there. No. Uh oh. Don't break. Don't break. Don't break. Whew. Wow, that would have sucked. 57 gold. Huzzah! I'm dead. Spear to the throat. Alright, we got some stamina potion. Or poison. Unusual gem. Alright. Some more books that I'm not... Nope. Definitely don't want to read it. No, wait, what? That was a... I don't know how you tell that some of these are... Like, the important quests or anything. Like I said last time. Like, I guess you're just supposed to read every single book that you come across. And hope that they do something for you. Or maybe it's usually just whatever's on the top. Like if the top one doesn't do anything, then they're not gonna they're all not gonna do anything, maybe. So let's see. Let's see that whole street. This one looks very important. And of course it doesn't do anything. The cake and the I think it's the same book that it shred. Lots of gold in here. Which is cool. Alright, well, I guess that's no, there's a door. Yeah, so all we have left is this spooky cave down here. But before we run in there, let's get our level up on. Uh, so yeah, I think we're gonna keep doing Magicka until something else, something else bad happens. Again, I'm still not too sure on what to focus on, so we'll probably just build those up till I find a spell. Oh, not the amiibo. Uh, that was totally nothing. Don't, don't look over here. You think I could distract him with an amiibo chest? Do you think that would, would that work? Oh no! No, I was, <laughs> I was hoping that would hurt him. Did my riches? Heck yeah, look at that! It like totally blocked the door. That's pretty good. <laughs> that was awesome. I didn't really think that that would work. Uh, we got some garlic, some gold, four red apples. Alright. Okay, now I've, uh, I believe I may have trapped myself. Which is probably not. Uh, oh, there we go. Aha! You weren't ready for fire. Neither were you. Alright. That worked out amazingly well. Um, yeah. So maybe... <laughs> that was pretty good. You know why... Well, it's kind of calmed down here. Let me see if... So I just used um, one of the champion amiibos from Breath of the Wild. Let me see if I summon that again. If I can use the exact same amiibo right after that. It says this amiibo can't be used again today. Okay. Well, since it's up, let's go ahead and use the Toon Link amiibo. That was some dramatic music and it blew some papers all over the place. It blew that warning all the way out here from the hallway. That's per some pretty serious wind. Waker. Huh. <laughs> uh, don't need either of those. Uh, definitely don't need a bucket. Oh, there's another note. Roris's letter. Come on, it won't be that bad. Rigel may be paranoid, but she's a dumb as a mammoth. Okay, so Rigel is a she, apparently. 
body hair like one too gross i'm just saying if we can get into that treasure room we would be set we could just take the money and head north to catch a ship i know a guy whose cousin knows a guy that could get us set up with some pirates in hammerfell and in the meantime we could live high on that money for months uh-huh yeah okay Ooh, definitely take garnet, some gold, lock, lock pick. Can always use that. Uh, all these guys are still wearing the same armor, so not too much, not too surprised there. Some style and boots. So uh, not bad. Boots. Uh, it's got a hide helm. Lots of other stuff I probably don't need. Heavy armors and stuff. Let's get and loot this bad boy. Ooh, don't need that dagger. Worry about that later. I just picked something else up. I don't know what that was. It's a pretty sweet hat. It's like half of a Santa Claus cap. Um, that could be interesting to interesting to mess with. Just for the heck of it. Let's see what that looks like on ye old amiibo night. So we apparently have whatever that is. Let's check that out. Whoa, that is not what I thought that was going to look like. Okay. Um, not really sure how I feel about that. Let's try that other one. I'm going to go ahead and drop that. <laughs> That's pretty good. Almost looks like I'm like reverse bald. Like I am bald on the top, but have hair on the sides. Uh, yeah, I don't, not really feeling that either. Sorry, amiibo mage. One day we'll find, find some sweet stuff for you. Since we're looking at stuff, see if there was anything else I randomly picked up, but doesn't look like there was. Oh, didn't I pick up a? No, just a letter. Okay. Never mind. I guess we're good. So let's... Actually, let's quick save real fast. And then keep exploring in this cave that we've been trapped in for three hours. Which is like four days in Skyrim time. Alright, so this is pretty cool. There's a... What's going on over there? It's just wood on the table, I guess. This is pretty sweet. They've got like their own um, like bar back here in the middle of a cave, which is a little weird. But I mean, hey, you gotta do what you gotta do when you're the bandit. Let's check this, uh, this sack out down here. If I could target it, but it doesn't. Oh, there we go. Definitely need potatoes. Probably don't need the poisons, but you know, I'll take them anyways. Grilled leeks, yes, please. There's like 20 of them. Yes, yes, yes. Take all the food I can get. Look at all those baked potatoes. All right, uh, I was kind of hoping I could cook there, but uh, it doesn't look like I can, so I don't even care. Let's keep going. Another warning. Uh, yeah, so that's the same, same thing, okay, and it fell into the wall, so you know it's serious, oh my gosh, did you see that blow out of the wall, and then apparently, oh, I was going to say, it looked like it ripped itself in half, that's serious business, oh, I see, uh, I see some, oh, I was like, maybe I see some human legs in there, but I don't think I do. Uh, let's see what's going on in here. Lots of animal remains hanging from the ceiling, which is never a good sign. Uh, okay, this is kind of weird. Now maybe there's, maybe that whoever wrote the notes is wandering the grounds, maybe. 
Or maybe that's just where the... This is where those... Whoa, that broke fast. This is where these bandits hang out or something, maybe? They share a bed. Whatever. Is that it right there? Let's try that. Yeah! Uh, don't need that. Definitely do need 47 gold. Heck yes. Keep the gold coming. No, no, no. Do you need health potions? I will always take those. Dang, even more letters. Uh, I don't. Man, that person was all about writing those warnings, huh? They're like all over the place. Ooh, that book looks suspicious. And of course, it does nothing. Yeah, so. I just. I don't know. I don't care enough to click on every single book I found to hope that it does something. I just set those bones off. Hopefully that didn't alert anybody. That book in the middle looks pretty big deal though. Nope. Not a big deal at all. So while we're in here, let's see if we can. I don't really think there's anything here that I need to improve. Leather. I don't have any of that. Alright, let's, uh, let's keep exploring. Ooh, gold. Yes, please. Is there another note on the wall? Gotta be getting close to whoever's laying all those notes, right? Oh, more dead bodies. Amulet of Kianrith. Increase my stamina. Okay. I will equip, equip that. Not a click it, but equip it. Yes, please. Bet it looks real badass under my robes. I can just sense it. Keeping my stamina up. It's, uh, ooh, master. Ain't no master lock gonna keep me back. I'm gonna break into every door I find with unbelievable efficiency. I'm sure this is real exciting to watch since you can't actually feel what I'm feeling. Oh, master. Master locks. I forgot that these have a very subtle, super subtle vibration. Nope. So let's go slow. Oh, there it was. Oh, found it. Right next to where I was. Cha cha. Man, that gave me a lot of experience. Let's do more of those. Um, okay. Room with a fire in it. Alright. Maybe there's some... Ah, here we go. Here's what I was looking for. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I wasn't ready for that. Um, hopefully that stops. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, jeez. What do I keep stepping on? Okay. I'm just gonna go... Oh god! Please let me through. Woo! Um, let me heal real fast. Oh. Alright. Get my flames back. Okay, so that. Can I set on fire? Maybe? No? No. Alright. Um, so that's a big old trap right there. I'm gonna guess that launches some some axes. Let's go ahead and quick save. You think I can amiibo jump over this switch? What's the uh, B is run? Y is jump, so let's see if I can do this. <sighs> All right, take a deep breath and Summon your amiibo. Oh my gosh. Whew. 
Okay, I don't think I actually jumped at all. I just kind of very quickly ran over. Holy moly! Yeah, <laughs> that's pretty good. Uh, so I believe I just activated another trap that did something horrible to my body. So that's that's exciting. So let's try that one more time. Um, maybe I can sneak around this without activating it. Yeah, maybe that's all I need. So that is what I stepped on. And I think it was that thing that killed me. So let's try to go slowly around that. And there's another trap right there. What? Oh my gosh, what did I do? I did something. I don't know what it did, but I'm sure it was something. Let's uh, open this door. Wow. Good trap. Are there really, like, no enemies in here? There's another trap. This is gonna be kind of, um, anticlimactic if there's no epic battle in this cave. Oh, there's my cat crying again. Yeah. Get some gold. Um, some big old treasure chests. And all of this stuff. Look at all this treasure going on right now. Okay, this was, um, I think this was worth it. I was kind of hoping for some form of epic battle, but this'll do. A weird grave covered in single gold. Let's try not to sit on that trap. That's silver candles stick. Okay. Curious silver mold. Let's take that. I don't know what it is, but I'm sure we need it. Don't need that. Do need that and can maybe use that in the future. All right, well, I guess that was that cave. So let's go check out Pine Watch. Woof, that was a heck of an adventure. That was a th three episode cave that guy had under his house, under his single room house. Felt like just yesterday we were looking at a, opening a door and looking at a basket filled with wine bottles and wondering why. Aw oh, jeez, is there more? Are you kidding me right now? This just won't end. Okay, so it says I cleared it, so I guess we just go outside now. Alright. Um, alright. see if I can find my way out of here. I'm glad all the dead bodies are still laying here forever under this guy's house. Yeah, back where we started. Ooh, let's see what this fancy contraption does. All right. It's kind of a kind of a weird feature of your house, guy, but that's all right. I won't judge you. Oh, I like that it's warning me I'm about to steal even though everybody in this house has been murdered. That's okay. All right. Well, let's go uh, get out to Skyrim. See what actual outside looks like. Oh, I forgot what the outside looked like. It's as beautiful and dark as I remember it. So let's uh, go out here into the open a little bit. Get our bearings on the map and see kind of where we, where we were. I uh, believe in like the second we got outside I said I was heading for uh, Riverwood and then immediately decided to run in the opposite direction of that and get lost for four days so 
maybe uh, maybe that'll be our goal. Is just to uh, go straight for straight for Riverwood. See what happens. Get this show on the road. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Been going a little while, and uh, it feels good to be outside. That cave took way longer than I was expecting it to. But uh, hopefully y'all enjoyed it, and I'll see y'all next time. Bye! Bye.